I'm Dixon Ponce and this is my red cabbage pH testing lab. First I'm going to bring my water to a boil and once it's boiling I'm going to add cabbage leaves into the water and wait until the water turns red or purple. Now that the water is at a boil I'm going to put some cabbage leaves I will now wait until that is red or purple. Now that the water has turned purple, I'm going to put the strainer in this bowl and strain, pour the water into the bowl. I've let the water chill, and now I can pour it into each cup. The first one we're going to do is mouthwash. As you can see, it became a little lighter, so therefore the mouthwash is slightly acidic. Second is lemon juice. As you can see, the color changed to red, so it is very acidic. Third is milk. And mainly purple, so therefore milk is near neutral. Next is water, but as you should know, as anybody should know, Spilt a little bit. Water is neutral. Next is a very well known acid in vinegar. And it turned red, so therefore it is acidic. Next up is baking soda. And as you can see, it turned to a darker blue, so therefore it is basic. Next up, I've got my antacid. The antacid didn't change a whole lot, so it is near neutral, but maybe more towards acidic. Eighth is cleaning solution number one. It is maybe a little lighter, so it's near neutral, but more towards the acidic side. 
the ninth one is Scrubbing Bubbles Mega Shower Foamer. So it's cleaning solution number two. But well, it's got pink bubbles foaming at the top. It's turning a little bit red. So we know it's slightly acidic. Um, stirring it around made it a little more, but I would say that cleaning solution number two, yeah, it's, it's going to be more acidic. Decently kind of close to neutral, but I'd say it's an acidic pH. And the last one is cold medicine. Turn a little more, a little more red. I'd say it's near neutral, but more acidic. So, yeah, there we go. That is 10. That is 10 different pH testers with the cabbage water. So, thank you for watching my video. Hope it was good.